So when painting hair, it's just like anything else. You want to block in the hair and just apply a couple thin coats. Now I'm leaving a really, really tiny line of black and there's a reason for that. Um, it's an old technique called black lining. You can either do it before or after, but you leave tiny lines of black or dark blue paint to separate um, the different areas on a model, especially older models don't have a lot of delineation in the sculpt. And so you want to kind of create the illusion of space between the different mm. parts. And so we'll go back over later when the skin dries and I'll show that to you. And like it's hard, for example, to see where that cap begins and the hair ends. So I might be going over a little bit, that's okay. And so after this dries, we can highlight it just a little bit and we'll paint the cap in as well. So we'll let that dry, we'll put another coat on in a moment. And if I were painting the full figure, I'd go back and do the same brown. 